Hey friends, it's Mossy here. Welcome back to the Let's Play. In the last episode, we got our most productive day, and in this episode, I'm coming out of a failed recording that I'm going to be uploading as a bonus video at the end of the series, because, quite frankly, I think it's too funny to not let uh, the world see, but at the same time, doing it how I would if I continued recording the way I did it. It would make the video way too long for my liking. So we're not gonna do that, instead we're just gonna do the day as normal. Um, so... Unfortunately, the original plan for Day 15 has become a bonus video that I will be airing after uh, the main series has completed. As it stands, I have two bonus videos planned for the series. And hopefully you will come to enjoy them. Oh my god, guys. Come on, we have one blue leaf in there. We can have them that bit. Alright, come on. Come on. So we're just gonna have the day with 50 reds and 50 blues. Um... Because that's really all we need for the day. we dismiss our blues, and we're gonna get our reds here. And we're gonna start the day off by having a rematch with an old friend. Whoop. No, 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 this is already on terribly. No, guys. So, hey, it's the Armored Cannon Beetle. Remember him? I don't know what just happened there. We discovered the bow sprint. With this piece installed, my ship should regain some of its sleek shape. Um. Are you guys gonna. What is happening? What is. What? You two help him carry that back. If you guys do good enough, if I do good enough, it will come back and you guys can have the body as payment for me accidentally getting 15 of your brother's squash. Okay. The Pikmin that are carrying are supposed to be milling about in one place with their loads. It appears that their path back to the enemy was blocked and faced with what seems to be an insurmountable obstacle. They have lost their focuses and are so glad that the was blocked in a way to do it so they really problem. Which we will do after we kill this guy. So I will not lie. I've been, uh, playing Pikmin 2 in my spare time because uh, of uh, reasons. And. Coming back to Pikmin 1 during the Pikmin 2 playthrough, holy moly, you throw Pikmin so much slower in this game. They generously boosted your speed in which you throw Pikmin in uh, Pikmin 2. Anyway, thankfully we got him down. Now we. I want to go get the bow sprint, but at the same time, I'd rather just start doing this stuff. So, we're gonna have to kill these water dunkers. No, 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 I'm gonna leave 15 blue up there. I'm gonna leave the rest down here. And then with our... Please tell me I was right. Yes, good. Alright, and then with the rest of our blues... Well, they carry back that Ionian jet. We're gonna have our blues cost up there. I think we need, like, that should be a fine amount. 
So this is going to be our introduction to candy pop bots because we've seen them around, but we haven't really used them at this point. I think that should be enough. So what candy pops do? Can candy pops. What candy pop bloods do is they change Pikmin to from one color to the other. So if you throw in a yellow one, they yeah, become yellow Pikmin. Um, now I do think their official names are actually different. I believe it's something more around like lapis lazuli candy pop bloods. Um, I, I I don't know the other ones. I've always just personally called them. Uh, we're definitely gonna need more Pikmin for that. How much is that? 20. Damn. Alright. Well, we have the numbers. We can do it. I was hoping it wouldn't be that many, but, um, we have here 9, and we just get to 9. Okay, I'm just gonna, for my own sake, I'm just gonna throw these guys down there. Oh, they got the iron and jet back, nice. There we go. Number two Ionium Jet. The answer for these jets boasts that with excellent mileage that's easy on the family budget, this jet will keep your wife smiling and propel you to a happy home life. Alright, so now what we gotta do is gonna pluck our newly christened yellows. I think I made too many. No, I made just enough. I gotta throw them over to the beach. And then gotta whistle them back over to us. Put them up there. Please don't do this to me. Alright, they'll start carrying that down. Found the Kronos Reactor. Using strange new technology, this machine is able to warp the space-time continuum and turn into energy. I'm constantly amazed at how many mysteries are locked inside the parts of my ship. Uh, so, apparently Olimar's a fan of Chrono Trigger. Which I've never really played, but I think it's really good. Uh, okay, well, come on. Come on, team. You guys gotta go back to blues. Yeah, the problem is, if we don't turn these yellows back into blues, uh, we'll have to leave them behind. I mean, I guess technically, if you're good enough, you could probably throw them. But, uh, I'd rather them just turn back to blues anyway, because blues are more useful than the blues. I mean, at this point in time, they're all useful in their own sense. But, the, the blues would be more useful for carrying this treasure back, so we'll just do it how it is. Unfortunately, they're all leaps now, so they're gonna be a bit slower. But, now that that's done with, we can go back to the reds who are apparently meandering over in the distance. Um, as you can see, they're, they're having quite the dance party. And it's that bridge we need to finish. So we're gonna do that now. And while we do that, because I still feel bad for somehow flubbing up my uh, attack on the armored cannon beetle, I'm gonna go grab. We're gonna put those blues away. And we're gonna go grab some extra red Pikmin. And we're gonna let them get back the second cannon beetle. Actually, before we do that, uh, we're gonna get these guys some nectar. Hey. Oh boy! Alright, um... I don't even know if that will actually give us enough room to get enough to get up. Oh, yes it will. Alright, so we're just gonna fill up the rest of these reds. Right, I'm just sorry, I, I just noticed the the yellow wally walk uh, sitting in the background menacing. Menace. That's a verbal slip up. Anyway, what I'm trying to say is I just saw the menacing yellow wally walk. Oh, I think 
Clearly my mind is too distracted about that yellow wallet walk because for some reason I genuinely thought I was walking with blue Pikmin there. <laughs> that was bad. Chronos Reactive is reactor change permutations of the space-time continuum to pure energy basically just like a big rubber band. Alright. Well, now that that's over with, okay, fine. You guys can have fun dealing with that. I'm gonna get the rest of these these guys to start carrying back this thing. The music that's playing right now is insinuating that there's something hostile nearby. But nothing hostile is nearby, so I'm just kind of confused. Anyway, you, you guys earned this thing because I made a mistake and got a whole 15 to be murdered. And that, I, I take full blame for that. That was, that was a big oopsie on my part. Alright, I'm gonna cut ahead till these guys get all this stuff back, so I'll see them. And they got it back. Oh, Sprint. The so-called face of the dolphin, in point of fact, I designed it. I have to cover 29 to 30 parts, increasing the dolphin's capability. I can now cover a wider area. Uh, so yeah, while, while, while they did that, I was just giving these guys some uh, nectar. Oh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna help them now. Uh, so, I'm actually just gonna cut ahead to the end of the day sequence here, because, well, I'm not gonna do much for the rest of the day, except get these guys their little armor and cannon beetle, and then, uh, get the remaining picks we have out here, and there's a bunch of them to get that nectar, so I'll see you back when the uh, other day ends. Alright. That's gonna do it. That's the distant spring. Uh, kinda crazy, but... It's... We're at the end. 29 out of 30 parts, we just need one more and the dolphin is gonna be fully transporting us out of here. Even though at the state it's in, it could fly off. Uh, screw you, Shearwigs, you suck, and I hate you. Thank god I'm never gonna have to see you again until I come back eventually. 15 days since impact, at last but a single part remains. Has ever covered 29 of the missing parts, the dolphin's power is near capacity. And the four steps below, I see a region where the final part must lie. Clearly, this is my final trial. My life support fails in 15 days. Courage. Uh, yowch, yeah, 15 to the cannon beetle and then two to the dumbbells. So not terrible. Uh, I, I really feel like I could have completely avoided the 15 boulders, but for some reason, I guess my throwing was off and I made them block it. Uh,. But either way, that's a good spot to head it off. And with that, we have the final area. So with that, in the next episode, we take on our final trial. Thanks for watching. See you then. Bye.